Taped patient evaluation one. Patient name is Victor Zaz. Diagnosed clinically insane after the murder of at least 20 women in the Gotham area. Hello, Victor. I'm Dr. Cassidy. Seeing as this is our first session, let's spend some time getting to know each other. I don't need to know you, Miss Cassidy. Everything is meaningless. Don't you think that's a very negative outlook on life, Victor? You've no doubt read my file. Yes. Yes, I have. It says you come from a wealthy family, that your parents died, and how you lost all the money gambling. And none of it matters. Why do you keep saying that, Victor? Because the only thing that does matter is the mark. Have you seen my work, Miss Cassidy? If you're referring to the marks on your... Of course I mean my tally marks. And I have a space for yours. Do you want to see where? Taped patient evaluation five. Victor is not responding well to treatment. Victor, yesterday we spoke about the people you killed. Ah, the zombies. They are all people, Victor. They are zombies. Continuously shuffling through the daily grind, waiting for someone to liberate them. You mean kill them? The police report states that you've murdered, or liberated, if you like, 20 young women in the last three months. Each had her throat slit and was left posed. They were all lucky to be chosen to receive my gift. I doubt they would agree with you. Really? How about you, Miss Cassidy? As you take the elevator to your apartment each night, open the six locks to apartment 433, remember you forgot to buy your cat food. Again. How do you know As where you I... sit down on your favorite red chair, cat on lap, just waiting for something to happen. I can make it happen, Sarah. I am your salvation. Patient's name is Victor Saz. For the record, the patient has transferred from Dr. Cassidy who is on leave after the incident last week. Hello, Victor. Please, take a seat. Guards, you can leave us. Sorry, Doctor. Warden's orders. I can't leave you alone with him. I understand. Hello, Victor. How are you feeling today? Victor, I can't help you if you don't speak. Depressed. Does that help you? Can you get into my mind, Doctor? Why depressed? I'm just thinking about the one that got away. The one I chose. I needed the mark. I want the mark! Victor has been more subdued recently. Response to medication has been poor. Hello, Victor. Is there anything you'd like to talk about today? Victor! This is going nowhere. God! Get him out of here! You heard the doctor. Get out. Didn't you hear me? He's got a knife! Get a trike in him! Get a trike in him! Oh, God! He's on Bill! He's cutting him! Get him off! Get him off! We need help here! Victor has been in isolation since the attack on the guard last week. As I wait for him to be brought up to me, I have had time to review his notes. I am increasingly worried. He cannot be cured. He has no empathy for his victims. Deep down, I believe he views all of us as potential victims. Doc, are you okay? What's happening? It's Zaz. He broke out of isolation. He's gone. Oh, God! Don't worry, Doc. You're the safest place. He's definitely left the island. Of course. But someone needs to alert the authorities. He'll need to kill again. Do you understand me? Needs to. Oh, no. He's gone after Dr. Cassidy. Hello? Sarah, it's Gretchen. Listen to me. Hold on. There's someone at the door. Sarah, do not answer the door. Can you hear me? Do not answer the door. It says he's free.